Hi guys and welcome to a new game for us called Door for Romantic. I must say this is a really, really chilled out game. Just listen to the ambience, the birds in the background. Casual little chill music. It's a really nice game. If you're getting stressed with life, jump into this. It's really fun. So what we got? I'm going to skip the tutorial. We've got classic mode. It's a very simple tile based game, right? As you see down in the bottom right hand corner, we've got number 40. This is the number of tiles we've got left in our stack. Big shout out to the devs, by the way. They sent me a key for this and I might be able to get hold of a couple of keys to give the game away. So if you're interested, drop in the comments, drop a subscribe, smash that like. Now, how does game work? As you can see, we've start off with one tile in the middle. On the right hand side, we've got the tile that we'll place. And then below that is the tile that comes up next. We've got a little bit of a water tile here. And it's got a two here. And basically, if we add at least two pieces of water to this tile, we will fulfill the quest. Likewise with this train, same thing, only with train track. Houses, pretty much the same thing. I put this tile down here. It says, okay, so I add three more houses. Again, it will complete a quest. Now, the quests actually give us more pieces. As you see down here, we've still got 36 because we've placed a few. So if we put this water tile in here, open us up a bit this forest tile over let's put it oh where should we put it let's sneak it over here and these houses so you see how we've got three houses here Add at least three houses to complete this quest well this tile here has got five houses on it so if i come over here you see it now goes to a tick they sat down quest and we got a little plus five down here so we've actually added more tiles to our pile so all you got to do is just kind of follow the quests and it will give you more tiles as you play along. Same with the fields. We add four more fields to this one. We'll complete the quest. Well, place it next to that one that's already got two there. Helps us out wonderfully. As you see here, got another water tile. I want to place that down. Now, I don't fully understand some things in this game. I don't know why I can't place this tile here, but it won't let me. So we'll just have to go here. Again, another house in tile. If I place it next to six houses, I will get the quest completed. And as you can see, there's a nice little place for it right here. But I must admit, this game, I mean, just listen to it. It's just so calm, so chilled, so relaxing. There's nothing too stressful about it. It's really quite peaceful, actually. So if you've had a bit of a stressful time of things recently, and just want to escape into something that's a little bit more mellow. Maybe see if you can check this game out. I'd love to know why I can't place these water tiles in here, though. Never mind. It is what it is. And we'll just carry on playing through. Now, building a little city like this is kind of helpful when we get these house tiles. It keeps us on the toes and able to just keep building the city where we like. See, that's interesting. It will let me put this huge body of water right here, which that's, that's going to be quite helpful for us. It'll enable us to open out like this. This wants to be placed by fields. And unfortunately, all of my fields I put end to end. So we're going to have to start a new set of fields somewhere. Put it here. Then all these areas around it will be joining areas that we can hook up to. This is a two field piece. So you see that number goes from six to four nice and easy it doesn't matter which fields you have matching up if you have the yellow fields matching up or if you have the autumn colored field matching up the game doesn't seem to really mind that much so you just place the fan do a little do see what you can work it to be so this is looking for 39 houses Oof. you can put it in here yeah why not will tell you as you see if i rotate this tile here what's that saying it says i will no longer be able to place any more forests around this tile because i've closed off the area that has the forest access around it if i put it this way though it means i can put more forest around here and it'll add to it because all the sort of forest paths are joining up nice and simply let's let that one in there and then we can fit two more houses there and we'll complete that quest. And um, again, we're gaining more tiles. It's a probably nice mellow game. I just really needed something like this right now. So I appreciate the devs for dropping me a code. Nice and chill. Brilliant little piece. I'm wondering if I can join these lakes up around here. Also got to be a little bit careful of what we do with our forest. I just don't want to lose too much. Field, and obviously we've got one field there. So we can do that. 
Hmm. I wanted to join those houses up, but those houses don't join up. They're on the wrong side of the tile. It's okay. We'll, do, we'll place it in anyway, get the field. It's not a problem. And that's another one completed and more tiles added to the pack. Slide the forest in there. Now, this is just like a classic mode. It also does have a creative option. They are looking at doing, by the looks of things, a couple of maybe monthly challenges. And just different game modes that we can do. There's a classic option like say that we're playing how, and there's a creative option that I think is pretty much endless, but I haven't actually looked at that yet. So here's a tile. It tells us we need to place this next to eight fields. If I put it here, you'll see that it will connect all those fields, but it puts a red cross there. The reason why that is is because we're just trying to connect it to too many. It wants to be connected to eight. And then by putting it here, we're connecting it to loads. So it's not going to allow it. But if I put it on this one, because the, these two fields are separate, it'll be fine. It, it doesn't have a problem with that one at all. Then we just got to slightly find a way, sneak this together so that we're not closing off all of our options, really. So we can slide that in there. So it's the same with this. This trees, this has got a big ask. So it starts off with 166 trees. But because we've got this little forest here, by the time we put it down, it goes yo. And it gives us 35. So that's a little bit better. A little bit easier to manage. I'm thinking if we... Oh, I want to spin that round so that the field's there. But it won't let me do that because the water will be the wrong way. I think it will just join that up, maybe. It'll be alright. Don't want to have too much water going on. If I can help it. There's one thing I'm not a fan of in this, and it's water. Water and trains, actually, because you can get in a right old pickle with them all. But then I think my brain is telling me ideally you want to try and keep keep the people happy and you know keep things as close together as you can get them. So we've got another little bit of water and field here. Maybe we sneak that in that way. We'll bring it this way and maybe we can loop these two up around, around the bottom over here. I've got to be careful here because I don't want to close these fields off. But I know that I've got... Well, I was going to say I know that I've got another field tile coming, but it doesn't look like I do. So if I put this tile right here where I'm looking to get the forest, it means the only place I can then place the next forest piece is here, which is then going to cause me problems with this water and train track, so I don't want to do that on that side. So if I put it here, though, I link up the fields and I link up the forest. Nice and chill. Place this one in here. I have snooked myself over here, actually. Or have I? No, I'll be fine. If I put that here, that means I can bring more forests this way. Boom. And we fulfill the quest that was required, and we get even more tiles. Now we're doing it. So this one wants to be next to 17 fields. Still not quite there just yet at that end, but we'll expand it nice. Ooh, okay, so here's something, right. So you see the issue that we've got this one here? If I put this down, it gives me two to this quest, but it will kill this quest off. So it's a little bit of a management system going on here now so that we can add to the right place without making a mess of ourselves. And if we slide this in here, ooh, there we go. If I put that there, it joins up all those little cities. Gives me the quest that we need to complete. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And we, yes, we can. That's what we wanted to see. Loop that up nice. I want to bring this round. Hmm. We bring this out here, there we go. And if we bring this body of water this way maybe then we can tile up that way Go this way so the forests are together here so we've got this one tile with a bit of field on it so we can do that and that will complete that and then we got our required tiles so that's always fun now these things are all right yeah so you can put train tracks in this so that will be helpful. So we've now got train and water together there. Hopefully it will resolve any issues that we've got. We'll put that down there. Hmm. Let's fulfill that quest. Bring this forest over yonder. We'll fulfill that quest and make that one even easier. Bring this round here just to close this off a little bit. So we've not got too much water everywhere. 
these five more over here. Four more, okay. Like, trying to think a little bit. Not always my best thing. Just keeping an eye on that train track up there. See so if something in there. Okay, there we go. Now we can... Bring the train track away a bit, but it's also given us those two things. We've got three more fields coming up after this tile. I've got our houses here. Bring those three fields there. I'm starting to build up the area. Nice. Forest. Nice, nice, nice. A big old lake that we can just put. Actually, we can put it here. Or we could even... No, we can't put it there. We can put it here and it'll close off that lake up there. Bring the train track around there, maybe. Now I need a little bit of a Y or a fork. But what we can do, though, is we can close that off so that's no more problem. So that's one plus, so that means that we can put this one down here. Because it's asking for one or a bit more. Or at least nine it was, I think it was. <laughs> anyway, we'll put that there. This needs some houses. Ooh, we've got to be careful now where we put this. Because if the only place that we can put houses for this set of tiles is here. So ideally I want a large city piece so that it's not going to close off. Or away... Hmm, okay. I think maybe we, we look at starting a new city somewhere else. About off the back of this stuff up here. Yeah, we'll bring a bit more up here, why not? A little bit of water. I want to bring it the other way around. It won't let me come down. Okay, let's place that in there after all. We do want a load of forest. Brilliant. Now you can bring the water around here and start to close this. Oh, this looks busy. This looks real busy. We can do that. Yeah, there we go. Maybe start bringing some fields out somewhere else. Just there, that'd be lovely. Ooh. Bit crazy in the old river. A few more houses. Now these have got a cut through, so if I put that there, it means I can put another house here. But we have a windmill. Must be placed near 29 fields, so if we start up here, and this one wants to place near 30. Woo! We'll bring this one up this way. Try and keep this forest nice and... This ain't nice and open, but if I close that off there, then... Yeah, we'll close it there instead, why not? off this water here again I've got to cut through with this piece of city so we can place that down and not foul ourselves up too much uh -huh, a little bit of water and housing so I could put that there and you see how it closes off both of those little ponds of water that makes it into a nice little loop doesn't matter which way I put it I can do that close them both off I think we'll do that that'd be a nice little place to live by the lake or at least I think so anyway Oh, I've got to think about this. So if I put this here, and any more tiles up this end of it, it actually closes me off. So the only other place I can place a tile would be down here. That would be alright, because there's plenty of room around here. Just close off that edge. I'm thinking maybe if we can link up these around that windmill, we'll be okay. What have we got here? Three. There we go in here. Ooh, we got water and some field. And some house. Yeah. I want something nice to put here, but I don't know what yet. Yeah, we keep getting like little tiles of uh, forest. Stuff like that, but... I don't know, you know, it looks like it should be something more. Should branch this track off to go the other way as well? Let's 
Escape for forest run. So that's good, so that will link both of those up together. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Come down here. There we go. There we go. That's that's alright. This place still needs three houses or more. So we can send that in there. Do that quest. Another five tiles. It's just about slowly building those tiles up. I can link that up. There you go. So that will place that down there. It was everything we need for the windmill. Another five tiles. 100 points for that as well. That's sweet. Put another one of these bad boys down here. Go here. In a forest. There we go. Okay, so we've got a lot of housing on this one. Need a lot of housing up here. Why not? Yeah, it's even better. I know that there is a Y piece. I'm hoping for that piece. So we're linking everything together. Ooh, what does this see? So this needs to be near 15. So I've got a choice here. I can either decide I'm just going to try and build up this one. And this one, or look at placing a new set of fields somewhere else. I'm feeling, I'm feeling that we're going to struggle if we try to start placing more fields somewhere. I'm going to start closing off other areas I don't necessarily want to be doing. This only needs three. If I'm not too careful, I'm going to end up snookering myself. Um, oh, oh, screw it. I'll go for these two. I'm not worried about that one. I'll go for them two. Hey, there we go. <clears throat> oh, I need one more piece to finish off that train track. So if I do that, okay, I've got an idea. I've got an idea, but I'm having a bit of a gamble on what tiles will come up. So it might not work at all. There we go. Nice little rocks that we put that there. Boom. Perfect. And I got a load of extra tiles for doing that as well. So that was so sweet. So I can fill that in there, look. I can fill that in there. We get that one complete. And this one's not got many more to go. I can chuck that in. Come on, train track. Why are you going to be like this to me? I'll be careful. Go that way. Ah, he would do. <laughs> So that's going to be a little city piece in there as we're closing off all that farm fields up there. Oh, it's too much now. Snookered. So he needs 18. Uh, let's build a little, little city out this way towards the ice. Ooh. Go towards a spot to uncover the special tile. Okay. Oh, nice. That needs a lot of fields. This needs a lot of wood. Hey. That does need a lot of fields. Ooh, we got a stoppage for the train. Nice. Um, 
How many regrets am I going to have if I put this down here? I'm going to have to build a new train track somewhere, aren't I? Probably. A little bit of water. A little bit of water in the field. There we go. Uh, this way? This way. These forest tiles are getting big now. They're asking for like 500 and some trees. Which is not too bad. Like we're working it out so that we can put it down. And we're getting some. Need two more pieces of water to fix in here. We're looking good. What else do we need? Still this city over here. Starting to crowd myself out with... West. Oh, I need... One house. One tiny little house up there. Right, you've got to try and remember that. One house up there and one house down here. Oh, I put it there, though. Boom. Sorted. It's beautiful. Now, this needs hundreds. So, what are we like over here? That's good. A little bit more water. I really kind of wish we didn't have so much water, but... We also get that water challenge completed. More forest. Beautiful. One house. There's one house up here. There you go, look. So we can just go place that one house there. Another complete. So now we're running out of tiles. We've only got 20 tiles left. Only got 20 tiles left. There we go. A few more tiles. With some water to it as well. Let's bring it down here so all the water is. Now, hopefully, this tile can go in here. All oh, right, so that needs 544 trees. And if I place that one tile. Woo! Nice. It's a little overshot of our land as it is right now. I was just trying to slowly eat through these tiles. I don't know about you guys, and I know you probably can't hear it because I'm talking too much. Just listen to how peaceful this is. We're going to start some new train tracks. Let's start some new train tracks. Down here. Close this area up. There we go. Bring this through. More fields. So this needs eight more fields. This needs 38 more fields. So we'll play for this one. Put that train track here it is five more houses do that is get itself five more tiles nice Train track and water. Mm. That might work. And then we can close that off there. Nice. Slowly run out of tiles now again. Trees, can you help us out, please? No. Ooh, that's not good. That one's 55 fields. Oh, boy. And a little bit tight now. Two. And then it'll just need me one. Hey, there we go. We can put that there. It gives us five tiles. It's, it's getting kind of touch and go now. 14 more tiles to go. Oh, I don't know where many fields are open up here. But it's only this one place. 
This needs 26 fields right this area. I put this down here, it'll give me 16. Nice, nice. Forestry. Forestry and train track. Yeah. Yeah, we'll place that there. Big old chunk of water. 15 houses. Well, that needs four though. Okay, what about Ah, it's too many. Snookered. So how about how about that? Put one in there. So let's get the one around there. Oh, wait, let me rotate it. I want to get the one onto that little guy. Oh, let me do that, though. I can go there. Why not? Uh, you can see we're coming right to the bitter end here. I don't think we're going to have enough tiles. I need three houses and this is two, so it's going to go over. Yeah. And one little last piece of the puzzle is a train track. That wasn't too bad. I mean, it is 418,000 on the leaderboard, but it's a really mellow, chilled out game. And it's, I don't know, there's something about it that's just so fun. But I think it's because it is so mellow, you know? Beautiful game. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Take it easy. Bye for now. Bye, everybody.